ciao beautiful strangers and welcome to cat reacts i'm cat and i react to mostly 80s and 90s films if that is something that interests you then why don't you subscribe today i'll be reacting to a film called jaws in the jungle i've heard of this film many many times before i've heard the song jaws in the jungle and i know it stars brendan fraser who is one of my all-time favorites yeah jaws uh, in the jungle i think based on the poster it's something related to tarzan or something like that but i don't know i guess i'll find out if you want to join me on the journey of discovering what this film is all about then great hop on and let's go hi everybody me again <laughs> and these are the wonderful quarters wave guys and this is our guide mr kwame without him we would be lost hi. and this is lyle i'm guessing lyle is not a favorite of yours love how did you find me? Well, I just hired the two best trackers in the business. Ha! Huh. Tomorrow we're gonna climb the mountain where the big apes are. Ha! Huh. Me and Thoria would be happy to help you and the lady up the mountain, Mr. Van der Groot. The apes are supposed to be a fascinating sight. Especially that white ape. White ape? The people say he's over seven feet tall with the strength of a lion. By day, he rules the entire Bakubo from the top of the mountain. But by night... He and Bigfoot run the candy counter at the Bakuvu Cineplex. Oh god, I hate disrespectful people. I hate them. Bigfoot? Max, that'd be worth a lot more than any white. <laughs> I was on a bridge like this in Maui. It was steady as a rock. See? <gasps> hey, stop, 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 hey, that. stop. Dude, what are you doing? <laughs> Don't worry, nobody dies in this story. Did you see the look that guy just gave me? Yeah, because you're an idiot. You nearly killed him. If they turn on us, we're never gonna get home. Well, then be nice to them. Oh, come on, let's go. Where? Find you an ape so we can get the heck out of here. Why we can't go into the jungle alone? We could get lost out here. My job to get you what you want. You want a white ape? I'll get you a white ape. She never says you wanted a white ape. Shh. Don't move. You mean I actually found one? <laughs> I'm gonna go get help. Oh yeah, run. That's a good idea. Tarzan! <laughs> okay, a very dumb Tarzan. <laughs> White ape man. You're too embarrassed to tell him that you were knocked out? I held him up as long as I could. Blood everywhere. My girlfriend. <laughs> what? Hello. <laughs> Feeling better, fella? Yeah. Oh. Oh, no, 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 don't worry. Ape friend. Hey. Something funny about this fella. She's not a fella, George. She's a woman. The female of your species. What's your name? Ursula. Are you? George. And that brother, Ape. Mm -hmm. Ah! When I woke up this morning, I remembered about that lion, and <laughs> I know you saved me yesterday. I don't want my fiance, this guy that I was with, to worry, so, so I should probably go and look for them. Ursula want to go already? Ursula have to go. Okay, George, help. Get trusty doggy. Oh, you have a dog. That's great. Hey, boy! Come on! Hey, boy! Somehow I get the feeling the Shep is not a Chihuahua. That's your dog? That's an elephant. This Shep! He looks like he's a bit mentally unbalanced. George and Ursula set out on a desperate search to find her fiancé. That guy she was with. This film was so messed up, but I don't, I'm not hating on it though. But by the end of the afternoon, her desperation had dimmed. That was fantastic! Oh! Where are the monkeys? Where? There. Oh, he's distressed. There? How many? Ooh. That many? Tell George more. 
No. Little monkey say other monkeys call little monkey runt. Oh. Not let little monkey play games. He's being bullied? Oh no. You okay? No. No. Oh my god, that was the sweetest no. Okay, my heart has melted. <laughs> 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 So now he's a big boy. Ah! <laughs> There's something charming about this film. George, what on earth are you doing? Folks just feel like looking a little special today. That all. Possibly there is a stirring of special feelings within you. George having stirring of special feelings right now. I see. Good thing she's same species, huh? Yes. So, so. Hey, come back here. They're not abandoning us, are they? They are threatening. Tell them I'll pay 50 Zamolis a man if they'll help me capture the white huh? ape and bring him back alive. 100 Zamolis a man and you got a D. Did you fight a crocodile for this? Oh, no, George not fine. Crocodile left toothache. Crocodile give to George after. Good juju. I have something like that too. I found it in a cereal box when I was 10 years old. Hi, Juju. Oh. I want you to have that. The nicest present George ever got. Thank you. <laughs> that was Ursula. She's alive. He's him. <laughs> hey, it's a dude. The white ape is a man. Ursula. <gasps> Liar, what are you doing here? Just based on how she reacts every time she sees him, I'm guessing she's not that in love with him. Oh, I was so afraid for your safety. Don't get all smoochy and disgusting with me, okay? I remember what you did when that lion came. I have no idea what you're talking about. Can we just go? George! Ursula, ready? Shoot, now! Hmm? With the train, what was a gun, idiot? A fight's worth a fortune! <laughs> Poor George was really shot, but can't die because, let's face it, he's the hero. Ursula Stanhope whisked George off in a private jet bound for the country of his birth, where he would get the finest medical treatment available. That's the guy who shot him. I never forget a face. We're gonna steal Georgie Boy's talking ape. You mean back up the mountain? How the hell are you gonna find that ape again? The jungle is huge. And our handsome hero was all the way to San Francisco. Love you, Mom. Gotta go. Bye. George, watch out for that! <laughs> Think of my jungle. This very high tree house. Poor George. He must feel so dumb. Well, Ursula's fiance is in prison, and there's a jungle man sleeping on her balcony. I got here as fast as I could. Where is he? He's under the water. He's in the shower. Not anymore. <gasps> George. Oh. Hi. George of Jungle. How am I gonna tell my parents that my fiance's in an African jail and that I brought home a jungle man? Tell them the truth and don't worry about it. I know you're there, Ursula. Pick up the phone and tell me why you have been avoiding me. Pick up the phone! Ah! <laughs> well, I think that was an overreaction. That's George. You kind of... think? I have to get on this boat. George! This coffee stuff really worked good. Which one are we taking to Vegas? The one who's playing chess. Checkmates. Too <laughs> key. <laughs> <laughs> Go find George. Humans on Earth, like why are we here? You just destroy everything. Thor. I have something very important to tell you, and I hope you'll understand. I don't want to marry Lyle anymore. <laughs> How could you do this to me? 
Don't you realize the caliber of people who are going to be here? They... I thought we would be introducing them to Lyle Vandergroot. And if Lyle survives that awful jail, you will simply have to kiss and make up. As for this evening, we will hold our heads high and we will carry on. Oh, oh Ursula, look how wonderful. Oh, 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 oh. Charming. Ooh, that is actually really delicious. Mom, Dad, this is George. Hello, Mr. and Mrs. Ursula. Mm. How do you do? So this is what you were doing in the jungle. Clever girl. Yeah. You are in love with my daughter. Ursula seems to reciprocate your feelings, and that does present a problem to me. No. Zebras marry zebras, and leopards marry leopards. Stripes with stripes, spots with spots. Well, Ursula is a stripe, and you are a spot. So you know what, Ursula, to love George. When Lyle returns, this wedding will proceed as planned. Pleasant mother-in-law. Dookie? Dookie! Ah, ah, ape kidnapped? George, save ape! He went back to the jungle. Where else would he go? The Hague? You got to him. Mother, what did you say? I simply said that if he really cared for you, he'd leave you alone and let you get on with your life and marry Lyle. I am not marrying Lyle, Mother. Don't be ridiculous. There's a big difference between marriageable material and a fling in the jungle. A fling in the jungle? Who says I had a fling in the jungle? You've been head over heels for that ape ever since you brought him here. Did you just say love? No. You did. Ursula. You're right. Don't say it. I love him. I'm out of here. Ursula! Father, do something! What would you have me do? There's obviously no stopping her. Oh, God. I'm hungry. Oh, shut up. This trail's taking us to the middle of nowhere. The sign at the trail leg said shortcut to Ape River. Actually, the trail is a fake. It circles Ape Mountain six times before heading right back to the treehouse. Oh, I knew we was lost. Oh, no. Poor Ape Man, brother. We're back at the treehouse. Well, I tried, but you fellas are just too smart for me. Oh, no. <laughs> Another inch! What are you doing? Get back there and work! Oh! 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 Haven't seen the light yet. Lyle. Lyle? I thought he was in prison. For the venal Vandergroot had escaped from the Bujumbura jail mm. and joined an obscure cult on the shores of Lake Tanganyika. Surprised, my little cupcake? You see, I'm now a mail order minister, capable of performing legally binding marriage ceremonies. Yeah, but you would have to force her to say yes. Well, I'm not marrying you. Actually, you are. Come on, let's go. Come along, my little African George. queen. Ah! See you later. Ah! Adios. Ah! Auf Wiedersehen. Why are you so hell-bent on marrying her? What's in it for you? Stop it! You're such a... Ow! 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 Looks like fun. Why is there a boat there? Lyle? Oh my god! Ah! Yeah, river rafting. Uh, river rafting is actually really fun. Done it twice. Really fun. <laughs> Thank God we've made it. Say I do, Ursula. Mm. Ah, that's it. We're married. Have a look at my bride. <laughs> no! What I came here to say was that I love you. Ursula loved George? So much. Wow. George loved Ursula, too. And so, George of the Jungle received the first kiss of his life that came from neither elephant nor ape. 
Ursula Stanhope finally got the simple wedding she had hoped for. And so ends our tale of that defender of the innocent, protector of the weak, and all-around good guy, George of the Jungle. A noble king, his beautiful queen, and their nimble young heir to the jungle throne. George, watch out for that! <laughs> okay, let's talk about it. Alright, that was me watching George of the Jungle. It was fun, it was heartwarming, it made me feel good. It was just all around feel good film. I guess this is a film intended for children. I guess this is sort of like a film if the parents of young children want to have like a family moment on a Saturday night, they sit down in front of the TV and put this one on because the kids would love it. They would probably laugh their ass off. And the parents can laugh at some jokes as well, I guess. So yeah, I, I think this film succeeded in what it was trying to do to be just this weird overall lunatic funny film for children i think i'll give it four out of five because it just it's a, it was a good film it was, it was idiotic but it was good if you like this video give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe i'll put on new videos for this week i'll see you in the next video